you really want to increase your level of success, think about prime time as it relates to you and the person you're about to interact with. Understanding prime time and utilizing it to your advantage will help to kind of give you an architectural game plan, blueprint as to when is best to have meetings, whether it's going to be a Zoom, a Skype, a go-to meeting, something over the internet where you're going to be engaging people, or when you're going to walk in front of a room or in front of a group or hold a meeting. When's the best time of day to, to do some heavy, intense energy sort of work, whether it's writing, research, putting together proposals, contracts, or doing a deep dive in your CRM and looking at contact names to do some house cleaning in your database. But prime time means this. Let me pose three questions to you. And so for you, quickly, mentally, or write down the answer. Number one, do you have your best professional energy in the AM hours or PM hours? There's no right or wrong answer, just your answer. So are you more of an AM person or a PM? So whichever you are, you now have letters defined in your head. I'm an AM or a PM. Number two, whatever the letters are you just pulled up in your head, now I want you to to define the window from where do you start to where do you end that makes up that window. So for example, I'm an AM person. So for me, I have my best energy in the morning. So if I define morning, I will define it by when do I normally start? So don't use any number to try to impress someone. But when do I normally start my work day? Not get out of bed, but start my work day. I typically start my work day at 6 a.m. So question number two is define AM or PM, and I'm an AM, then it would be from 6 AM to noon. That would be my window. If you're a PM person, it's going to be from noon to when do you normally end. Third answer is how you get to prime time. So now if you focus on that time frame you've just identified, prime time is within that window or where in that window do you have your best energy, most energy, and least amount of interruptions and distractions. That's when you want to schedule, if you have any choice in it, all of your high yield activities. So if I'm an AM person defined as from 6 AM to noon, you tell me when you think is probably the best window for my high intensity energy activities. Exactly right. From 6 a.m. to around 8 to 9 a.m. is the best window, least interruptions, etc. So if I'm on a Pacific time zone, as an example, I'm a 6 a.m. guy, perfect for me to be having meetings with people on the East Coast because they've already started their day. So think about when is your prime time because that's when you want to schedule your high yield activities. And if you can't schedule them around those windows, now be aware of the fact that you may be running on low energy. So you've got to kick the energy up if you're trying to get someone excited about what you have to offer.